let's say I'm testing only the timer feature, where it's like, yeah, if I give you there's only the, the end date is like after 30 seconds, I see 30 seconds, 29 seconds, and, and so. But it's like a really important uh, requirement or a functional requirement that all of these auctions are using the same timer from behind or like in the implementation. Otherwise, it's like we'll have, I don't know, 800 timers just for one page. I'm very tempted to write a test to make sure there's only one timer. Because, yeah, if, if something messes up, the, the, the <laughs> CPU will like, like go to 100%. But then like, OK, this is more implementation. Should I test it or not? I mean, this is where I'm a little bit hesitant. I don't know what should I do. OK, so if you're asking this question, it's because mm -hmm. you are afraid someone might change the code and end up using hundreds of timers. And you know what's going to happen. <laughs> So, and this person might be you doing it yeah. by mistake, right? Yeah. So if there's a concern that something might break in the future, and the only thing preventing from breaking is your memory, add a test for it. Yeah. <laughs> what if you are on holidays and someone adds a bunch of time? What if you forget? What if you are in a rush because there is a deadline to meet a marketing uh, strategy deadline and you need to do it? You know, don't rely on memory. Add a test for it. Mm -hmm. Yeah, just typically this hasn't has nothing to do about timers you know it's like it's more of a you know if you're afraid just you know hedge don't be afraid add the test and that's it yeah because the cost is low for adding this test even though it's going to be coupled with the production code it's not something that you expect to change right it's not it's not going to become a requirement at some point no we want to have two timers <laughs> right yeah. or we want to have 10 timers so it's not something that's going to change a lot so the cost is low to create and maintain it. And it will help you sleep better at night. And it will help you develop feature faster because you're not concerned about this thing all the time. You know? So use tests to free your mind from remembering how everything should be working. The test should tell you and enforce how things should be working. Okay. You know, so we have more brain capacity to focus on the important things. The more you try to keep things in your brain, like remembering things, <laughs> the less productive you will be. So don't rely on memory, automate it.